Hey guys, welcome to Whiting Brothers Have a Life. And today I'm going to show you how to make a giant Irish iced coffee. So the ingredients you're going to need is some Irish whiskey and some iced coffee. Today I've gone and got the, the dead double espresso iced coffee. It's quite tasty, you can use whatever you want. You can even make your own iced coffee just from instant coffee if you want. And you'll also need a bunch of ice. Use as much ice as you want, because I'm using such a big jug, I need a lot of ice. Bam, ice. Now this is going to take a lot of alcohol because it's such a large volume, and I want it to be pretty pixie strong. So I'm probably going to do about, uh, Say one or two or maybe three, maybe four, five, six. I don't really know how it's going to taste yet. We'll go with six and I'm up for some more in after. Okay, that's about just use one of these, uh, 750 ml. Um, I'm just going to use a little bit more out of the other one. I wasn't sure how much I was going to need, so I'm not too sure. There's a heap of ice in there as well, so we've got quite a bit of contents. Space. Make sure you give it a nice, good mix around. There's all quite a bit of damage in here, so I've got to to get it all agitated, I want to check all that. You know what? That's spot on perfect. Well, there you go. Giant Irish iced coffee. Cheers. So guys, you might have seen one of our other videos, if you haven't, you can click here um, to see it. And it is on uh, double brewed coffee ice cubes. So I just figured I might put some of these in with my um, giant Irish iced coffee. That should give me a bit of coffee kick.